and former MP Anand Mohan, who was given a lifetime punishment for killing an ISG Krishnaya, has been released from the Saharsa jail today after 15 long years. In 2007, Mohan was convicted for the murder of then Gopal Ganj district magistrate G. Krishnaya in 1994. He had been serving a lifetime in connection to this case. Now, as per sources, Anand Mohan is likely to hold a mega roadshow in his hometown. Meanwhile, retired IPS Amitabh Das will file a petition against the Bihar government's decision to amend the state prison rules, which would challenge the release of Anand Mohan. Reacting on Anand Mohan's release, G. Krishnaya's family condemned the move and said that Nitish government is setting a wrong and dangerous precedent. The family is also likely to file an appeal against the decision. Remember, a massive controversy erupted after the state government tweaked the Bihar prison rules which remitted prisoners' punishment for crime like murder of government service on duty. The BJP has accused the Nidish government of appeasement politics and even termed the move as return of Jungle Raj in the state. Anand Mohan has been released from jail and he has come out from the jail at uh, around 3 a.m. today. And uh, uh, at present, the supporters here are in a resort. They are waiting for his leader because Anand Mohan had left the jail without informing any media or uh, his supporters. But we have the exclusive information that uh, he is residing at one of his relatives' place in Saharsa itself. And at around 11 a.m., a rally will be held uh, in Saharsa, and then he will move to Pajgachia, uh, which is the native village of Anand Mohan. <laughs> ठीक है मर्डर कन्वेक्ट तो उन पर साबित ही नहीं हुआ उन पर ये साबित हुआ तभी तो नहीं नहीं उन पर ये आरोप लगा था कि भड़काऊ भाषण दिए हैं और भड़काऊ भाषण मुजफ्फरपुर में वो दिए डीएम का हत्या हुआ और उसके पांच मिनट के बाद वो हाजीपुर में आरेस्ट होते हैं राजपूत वोटर्स आनंद मोहन के साथ हैं सब समाज के वोटर आनंद मोहन के साथ हैं तो ये जो कानून में बदलाव हुआ है क्या आनंद मोहन की वजह से हुआ नहीं कानून कहीं से सही नहीं था ये आनंद मोहन को फंसाने के लिए लगाया गया था और फिर उन्हें को हटाने के लिए निकालने के लिए जनता के दबाव में उसको हटाया गया वो आए आए हैं बहुत बदलाव आएगा क्या बदलाव आएगा अब वो जो आगे करेंगे हम लोग साथ ही चलेंगे तो पता नहीं क्या बदलाव आएगा लेकिन बदलाव आएगा उनको मतलब जिस तरह हमारे प्रभु राजा रामचंद्र को बनवास हुआ था उसी तरह से निर्दोष होते हुए भी कानून का पालन करते हुए चौदह साल बनवास काटे हैं इसीलिए आनंद मोहन जैसे नेता को पब्लिक भी चाह रहा है कि वो बाहर रहे द रिलीज ऑर्डर केम एट थ्री एम इन द मॉर्निंग एंड आफ्टर दैट एट अराउंड फोर एम ही केम आउट ऑफ द जेल एंड वेंट नो सो आनंद मोहन इज नॉट ट्रेसेबल राइट नाउ बट वी आर here at his residence in Saharsa where the supporters were waiting for his uh, grand welcome but the leader has not appeared but we have the information that at some point of time he will be coming to this house and uh, till then the supporters are getting ready for his grand welcome you can see a pandal was made here with shade and uh, chairs are put uh, for his uh, welcome uh, आनंद मोहन यहाँ आने वाले थे आप लोगों को क्या उम्मीद थी कब आने वाले थे और आए नहीं तो कहाँ गए हैं कुछ आइडिया है आपको आएंगे आएंगे वो आएंगे हम लोग उन्हीं के स्वागत के लिए उन्हीं के इंतजार में खड़े हुए हैं क्या क्या यहाँ पे प्रबंध था हम लोग फूल माला के साथ उनका जोरदार तैयारी के लिए खड़े हुए अबीर गुलाल खेलेंगे क्यूँकी आज राम वनवास के बाद पंद्रह बरस के बाद आज अयोध्या के नगरी में आ रहे हैं हम लोगों को तो फंसाया गया हमने कृष्णैया की हत्या की ही नहीं है तो फिर हम दलित विरोधी कैसे हो बदलाव आएगा इनके आने से राजनीति में उतल पुतल मचेगी बहुत बड़ा बदलाव आएगा इनका, इनका पॉलिटिक्स आगे रहने वाला है बहुत बड़ा बड़ा बदलाव आने वाला है आने वाले समय में और बिहार ही नहीं पूरे देश की राजनीति में आनंद मोहन जी के समर्थक रहे हम जबकि आनंद मोहन का कर्म भूमि त्रिवेणीगंज के धरती से उसका जो है उत्थान हुआ आनंद जी कब से साथ है हम स्टूडेंट लाइफ से जेपी आंदोलन के टाइम हाँ उससे भी पहले अच्छा तो आप जेपी आंदोलन में थे जी हाँ अच्छा। जेपी आंदोलन से भी जुड़े गए थे जी तो प्रोटेस्ट करेगा उसको फिर जेल में भेजने के लिए ये तो पॉलिटिकली मोटिवेटेड है और उसको चीफ मिनिस्टर जी को प्रेजराइज कर दिया होगा ऐसा इसलिए ऐसा डिसीजन ले लिया इतना पब्लिक प्रोटेस्ट करने के बाद भी वो रिलीज कर रहा है बोले तो 
ये गलत है ऐसा केस इसको एंकरेज नहीं करना चाहिए चीफ मिनिस्टर को और कोई भी पोलिटिकल लीडर्स को और उसको बाद में इलेक्शन में कड़ा हुआ तो भी पब्लिक थोड़ा ये होकर उसको वोट मत डालना प्राइम मिनिस्टर जी को भी और प्रेसिडेंट जी को भी थोड़ा सा इंटरवीन करके इसको वापस लेना बोल के नीतीश जी को बोलेगा बोल के हम विनती कर रहा है it's very disheartening that uh, you know has been released from uh, the jail today i think government should reconsider this decision because uh, my father was a great civil servant uh, i mean something like this if something like this uh, happens in a military thing it's taken into uh, consideration very quickly i'm i'm hoping that uh, nitish kumar ji uh, should think about this and give it a second thought uh, that's all we are hoping for Absolutely. it's very unfair and uh, not just me but everybody around who are also speaking are thinking that you know the decision that has been taken by nitish kumar ji is absolutely wrong well appealing uh, definitely i mean if there is uh, nothing that's been taken into consideration then i think we will have to appeal to uh, the prime minister and also the president of india let's also now bring in our colleague saurav rathore who in fact has been getting us all those voices and also the mood on the ground Now, sort of, it's almost ironic that a dawn has been given a hero's welcome of sorts. Many supporters now saying that this is the day we waited for, comparing it to Ram returning from his Banwas as well. Politically speaking, the opposition continues to train its guns, saying that isn't this setting a very dangerous precedent? Yes, indeed, because uh, you know the change in rule that says that now. murder of a government servant won't be a, 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 a exception uh, to the rules and uh, that will be considered as a normal murder in which the maximum jail punishment is of 14 years but before that it was 20 years for which he was convicted uh, and uh, here we are uh, at the saharsa jail gate Uh, this is the place this is the prison where he had spent um, uh, more than 15 years and uh, because today he was released uh, because uh, uh, that uh, particular change in amendment uh, paved the way for anand mohan to come out of the jail and today is the day when their supporters on one hand you, uh, we have heard the family of uh, 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 late uh, krishnaya uh, they they all are uh, condemning the Uh, action that was taken by the state government the opposition uh, is slamming the state government saying that it's appeasement politics but on the other side we see the supporters have started pouring in they are ready to welcome their leaders and uh, it is scheduled here that at around 1 am the leader will reach here their uh, uh, supporters are have started coming in and from here uh, the leader will go to Uh, uh, ambedkar uh, statue where uh, he will garland the statue and and then a road show will be conducted uh, across the city and mm. uh, after that he will move to his native village uh, but uh, as as of now the supporters have started gathering here the reason behind okay. this Uh, a particular place at the jail gate is uh, because the earlier information was that uh, he will be out of jail at around 11 to 12 pm okay. so everybody across bihar knew that uh, uh, that mm. anand mohan will come out of jail at that time and because of that the venue for the road show hmm. to begin is kept here only although so he I was saw released uh, very early in the morning that but after uh, the at release of anand mohan he is going to actually carry out a road show many supporters already thronging areas and saying that the politics of bihar will now change so we will have to leave that conversation there keep tracking those developments for us some other political reactions also coming in महागठबंधन की सरकार कहती तो है कि यह सामाजिक न्याय की पैरोकार है सामाजिक न्याय की चिंता करेंगे जाति जनगणना करेंगे लेकिन सामाजिक न्याय के एक एक मोर्चे पे एक एक मोर्चे पे सामाजिक न्याय के नीतीश हों तेजस्वी हों और लालू जी हों सब ने लोगों को ठगने का काम किया है इनको ये पछता नहीं है कि देश में संविधान के सर्वोच्च स्थान पर आज एक आदिवासी की बेटी बैठी है आपका जो पूरा प्रोपोगेंडा है आप एक्सपोज हो गए हैं आदरणीय आनंद मोहन जी के रिहाई का रास्ता तो साफ हो ही गया था और उनके रिहाई में सारे नियम कानून कायदे का पालन किया गया है 